Okay, let's do a second one. Uh, this is from Chip McDowell. Chip says, "You don't know how much I appreciate you. You're coming at my life, coming in my life at the right time. Things happen for a reason. I sure agree with that. Uh, I've been in business all my life, but this is what I want to do. Uh, yes, I would appreciate your ideas on video. The question I would like to hear is uh, about getting my feet wet and diving in. I lost a business and have bad credit. How can I get around this prog problem? I didn't uh, claim bankruptcy because I intend to pay what my obligations are." Uh, do I need to bring in an investor? Well, let's let's start with the, the credit issue. You don't have to have good credit to be able to make this stuff work. Matter of fact, you're not getting new loans for anything, so nobody's ever checking your credit. Uh, it doesn't matter what your credit looks like. Now, if you're currently in a bankruptcy, you don't want to buy properties under your name because uh, it'll have to be declared in the bankruptcy. So work with a partner and, and you do it that way. But if you're not in bankruptcy or if your bankruptcy's been discharged and you've got a, uh, you know, you've got a, uh, 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 you know, the discharge papers on, the, on that, and you can move forward. And there's no reason not to go ahead and do things in your name and eventually get yourself an LLC and, and do it that way. So don't be intimidated by the fact that you have bad credit. Remember, you don't need credit. You don't need money for down payments to make these things work. What you need is the skills to be able to put the deals together. You have to be able to find the sellers, find the buyers, put them together, and uh, you'll make money. Uh, the, the rest of the thing here says, do I need to bring in an investor? And, and absolutely not. Everybody's looking for investors. All, new, all these newbie investors out there are looking for, for other investors who are, are established, who, who have money and uh, that, that, that want to invest. You don't need those people. I've had people come to me all the time and say, oh, I've got this friend. He's, he's willing to invest $5 million. And uh, I, I want to find the properties. I want to find the, the right deals for him so that we can split the profits. Well, you don't need him. If you do the deals the way I'm teaching, with uh, the structuring the deals the way I teach, you won't need an investor to make this happen. Learn to do this stuff without money. You know, if you can't do it without money, you'll never be able to do it with money. There are deals that make sense where you can have money and it'll make the, the process go smoothly. But you don't need money to get started. You don't need money to start making money. So keep that in mind as you get going through this process.